Hello everybody and welcome. In this video I'm going to show you guys how to download the FFG Armor 3 mods. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go into uh, Chrome or any web browser that you use. Just go ahead and type Armor 3 Sync. And then you can just click the Armorholic page. Go down to the bottom. Download it. It's not a relatively big file but for some it may take about a minute. Once it's downloaded you're just going to go ahead click it. It's going to be in a zip file. Use WinRAR or uh, 7-zip in there. Go ahead double click it. Run it. It's going to ask you if you want to run this if you have your firewall up. So just go ahead and click next. Accept the agreement. Wherever you want to put it. It already senses that I have uh, Armor 3 sync file in there. So I'm just going to go ahead and say yes to that. You can create a desktop icon if you want, then just install. Go ahead and run it. It's gonna, and then it's going to show up. You can go ahead and do the update if you wish. It doesn't really matter to me. It's going to ask to uh, find the Armor 3 executable. Alrighty. So after you give it your location of your Arma 3, it should look something like this. It's going to be in your Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Arma 3. That's going to be your .exe. So what you're going to do is you can go over to Repositories, which is on the very far right. You're going to go ahead and put in the auto config URL, which is going to be this. This will be in the description. You can go ahead and click Import. It will fill in everything. Click OK. So you can go ahead, check it, then you're going to go ahead, select it, then you can go down here to this, you're going to click connect to repository, then click the check mark, it's going to check for all the files that you need to download. Alright, after it finishes checking all the files, what you're going to do is you're just going to go ahead and select all these, go down here, and click start. Then it's going to start downloading them. It may take a while, uh, depending on your internet. For me, it took very quickly because I already had a lot of the All right, files. And then after it finishes downloading, what you're going to do is you're going to go over to Add-ons. Over here in Add-on Groups on the right side, you're going to go ahead to Add Group. You can name it whatever. I'm going to name it ARM3, or FG ARM3. Then what you're going to do is you're going to take your FFG Armor 3 Life, drop that in there, CBA, Lakeside, and TFR, which is Task Force Radio. Then you would just go ahead, click that, then just make sure Armor 3 is selected, and then you just hit Start Game. So now that you're in game, what you're going to do is just hit Play, Multiplayer, go ahead and hit Filter. And then you can just filter FFG or ARM3 Project Life. Click OK. And then sometimes it'll take a couple seconds for it to show up. I just kind of spam the uh, refresh until it kind of pops up. But ARMA is slow, so i got to give it some time to think. There it is. So you just go ahead and double click that. Go ahead, pick your slot. See, I'm going to be cop one so I can take care of McKinnon. Alright, there you go. That is how you download the add-ons. And have fun.